going for a fifth gold. Lauren Mitchell of Australia. First line's going to tell us a lot. Oh, just stays oh. in, no. That's going to hold her out of the gold medal, I think. She stayed inside, but she took a deduction. It's all right, but it's a bit low. to get this all the way round. No, she's put her hand down. She's not on the light, on the money today. Combination line here. It's okay, but it's still not her best. Each of the elements just a little bit off today. Finishes well. But the consensus seems to be that she'll be denied a fifth gold. And you can see it in her face. It wasn't her best routine, and I think Cairns has outperformed her today. So this first tumbling line, she set it back a little bit too far and she leans over to stop it from going out. <laughs> and in fact, I'm not quite sure if that red flag went up. And here she's just popped her hand down, touched it down. The judges may take away for that as well. So all through her floor routine, she's just a little bit off. You can't blame her in some ways. She's had a very big program. The pressure was on her to do well. And there again, slightly short as she lands the front layout. England's Imogen Cairns in the gold medal position with a score of 14-2-0. And I think that Cairns is just going to finish ahead of her. I hope I'm wrong, but I feel that Cairns is going to outscore her on this routine. She should do, really. Execution-wise, Cairns' was cleaner. Lauren Mitchell has four gold. Cairns has one for winning the vault final. So I think Mitchell's going to end up with four gold and the silver. It's still brilliant. And I'm pretty sure Cairns is going to come in ahead of Mitchell on this occasion. Judges Anxious are taking moment. their time. Yes, they certainly <laughs> are. As I said, I'd be surprised. I'm hopeful but uh, not confident. Australian camp, including Liz Chetkovic, waiting with bated breath, and it doesn't make it. And I think that's the correct, uh, the correct me uh, score for Mitchell's floor routine today. 13-9, 2-5.